This is Tech Talk HSC El Paso. Hello, I'm Veronique Masterson, and I have your news and events for this week. The Texas Tech Foundation Board of Directors' first visit to El Paso was a great success. The board meets quarterly to provide volunteer leadership to facilitate institutional advancement. Well, Texas Tech Foundation Board represents the four universities, and El Paso is such a dynamic part of the system, and the growth has been tremendous. So we brought the foundation board here to celebrate that great growth, as well as Dr. Lang's vision. Members met on campus Thursday afternoon, then enjoyed dinner at the house of Texas Tech University System and Mrs. Brick Francis. On Friday, board members returned to campus for their meeting, then attended the dedication ceremony of the Lawrence Tyler Francis Grand Lobby at the Gail Grieve Hunt School of Nursing. Regent Rick Francis, Mrs. Francis, and their son have always been great champions of the TTU system and its institutions. I would tell you that I think Tyler would be also very, very proud. This growing, robust medical campus that is, is going to play a large role in the future of young El Pasoans for generations to come uh, is a, was a very special place. Tyler, as a Texas Tech graduate, was also proud. Him and I were down here many times as we walked around with the kind of X's and O's and where things might go and what might be. And to have his name here on this special asset, this special place for El Paso, it will not only be a special campus, but this room will be a special memory for all of us. Tyler Francis, a Texas Tech graduate, was a huge supporter of his alma mater and hometown of El Paso. Tyler passed away November 24th, 2014. The TTU System Board of Regents unanimously approved the naming of the lobby during a May meeting in Lubbock. Everybody has been blown away. It's, it's really unique. A, a lot of the members of the Foundation Board have not seen this campus, especially since it's grown over the years, uh, nor have they had the opportunity to see uh, the vision that is here. Uh, Dr. Lang did a very good job this morning of, of going through the history and explaining the vision of where we're going. Uh, this board is excited about El Paso and the opportunities here for Texas Tech. Also Friday, the board joined more than 1,000 students, alumni, residents, faculty, and staff at Southwest University Park for Texas Tech Night at the Chihuahuas. This was the second year TTUHSC El Paso has organized the event for El Paso's Texas Tech community. Texas Tech University System Chancellor Robert L. Duncan threw the first pitch of the game against the Sacramento River Cats. Visit eptechview.ttuhsc.edu for more information about these and other stories. Guns up, we'll see you next week.